Psalm 22. God, O oh God, my God, why would you forsake me now? Why do you remain distant, refusing to hear my moaning, my groaning? I weep with desperate cries for your help. I can't stop sobbing. Where are you, my God? Yet I know you are most holy. It's indisputable. You are the enthroned God, surrounded with songs, living among the shouted praises of your princely people. Our Father's faith was in you. Over and over they trusted, believing in you, and you came through. Every time they cried to you in their despair, you were faithful to deliver them. You didn't disappoint them. But look at me now. I'm like a woeful, worn, crushed worm, crushed, and I'm bleeding crimson. I don't even look like a man anymore. Abused, despised, and scorned by everyone. Mocked by their jeers, despised with their sneers, spitting their insults. All the people poke fun at me, saying, Don't tell me this is the one who trusted in God. Is the, this the one who claims God is pleased with him? Now let's see if he'll come to your rescue. We'll just see how much he delights in you. Lord, you brought me forth safely from my mother's womb, and you are the one who cared for me ever since I was a baby. Since the day I was born, I've never, I've been placed in your custody. You've cradled me throughout my days. I've trusted in you, and you've always been my God. So don't leave me now. Stay close to me, for trouble is all around me. And there's no one else to help me. I'm surrounded by those violent foes, forces of evil swirling around me. They want to break me to bits and destroy me. They are many. They are mighty. Curses pour from their mouths. They are like ravenous roaring lions tearing their prey. Now I'm completely exhausted. I'm spent. Every joint of my body has been pulled apart. My courage has vanished. My inward parts have melted away. I'm so thirsty, parched, and dry as a bone. My tongue sticks to the roof of my mouth. You have left me in the dust for dead. They have pierced my hands and my feet. Like a pack of wild dogs, they tear me, they, they tear at me, swirling around me with their hatred. They gather around me. They maul my hands and feet. All my bones stick out. Look how they all gloat over me and stare with a toss of the dice. They divide my clothes among themselves, gambling for my garments. Lord, please don't stay far away. Oh God, my only might and strength. Won't you come quickly to my rescue? Give me back my life. Save me from this violent death. My precious one and only, from the power of these demons. Save me from all the power of the enemy, from the roaring lion raging against me, and all the power of his dark horde. I will praise your name before all my brothers, and my people gather... As my people gather, I will praise you in their midst. Lovers of Yahweh, praise him. Let all the true seed of Jacob glorify him with your praises. Stand in awe of him, all you princely people, the offspring of Israel. For he has not despised my cries of deep despair. He is my first responder to all my sufferings. And didn't look the other way when I was in pain. He was there all the time, listening to the song of the afflicted. You are my praise. It comes from you and goes to you among the congregation of your people. I will keep my promise to praise you before all who fear you. I will invite the poor and broken and they will eat until satisfied. Bring Yahweh praise and you will find him. Your hearts will overflow with outrageous joy. From the four corners of the earth, the peoples of the world will remember and return to the Lord. Every nation will come and worship him. For the Lord is king of all 
and takes charge over all the nations. There they are. They're worshiping. All the wealthy of this world will feast in fellowship with him. Alongside of them will be the humble of heart, bowing down to the dust, forsaking their own souls. They will all come and worship this worthy king. His spiritual seed shall serve him. Future generations will hear from us about the wonders of the Lord. His generation, not yet born, will glorify him. And they will all preach, it is finished.